there all across L.A. County. Officials urging people to gather supplies and other necessities now. It's just in case. The high winds and intense rain could bring some unwanted surprises. KTLA's John Finoli alive in Hollywood with more on what you can do to stay safe. John. Sandy Micah, good evening to you. Officials tonight are urging residents not to panic, but to prepare before the storm hits. Get ready, Southern California. This is potentially an unprecedented extreme weather event for Los Angeles, Southern California, and the rest of the West Coast. Hurricane Hillary is heading our way, and officials are warning residents to prepare now for potentially dangerous weather conditions Sunday and Monday. Our region is expected to receive anywhere from two to four inches of rain totaling across L.A. County with up to seven inches possible in the San Gabriel Mountains and the foothills. That means possible flash flooding, mudslides, power outages, even the possibility of isolated tornadoes. A flood watch will be in effect over the weekend with the threat of flooding in some areas as early as Saturday. Hillary is expected to weaken to a tropical storm by the time it reaches SoCal. However, emergency management officials say it could still pack a powerful punch with sustained winds of 40 to 60 miles per hour. There is a significant threat. L.A. city and county officials warning residents to be ready to hunker down, saying the window to prepare is quickly closing. I want to keep hitting home the point of how important it is to prepare, especially we know that this is coming. That means having enough supplies for several days without power, including packaged foods, at least three gallons of water per person, extra medications, a hand crank NOAA radio, flashlights and batteries, phone chargers, copies of important documents, and a first aid kit, just to name a few. Forecasters say some areas could experience a year's worth of rain in just two days, making recent burn scars susceptible to debris flows. Places like Rolling Hills Estates, where hillsides failed and destroyed at least a dozen homes last month, are especially vulnerable. L.A. County Sheriff Robert Luna says his agency is hoping for the best, while preparing for a worst case scenario. We do urge residents to please stay informed through the county website, news, and social media. Please prepare, please take this seriously. We are not used to hurricane preparation, but it's another example of climate change. So we have to be prepared for climate events that we are not used to. Stay safe, stay off the streets. All right, and for a full list of resources and other information on how you can prepare for the storm, as well as what to put in your home emergency kit, look for this article under our website, ktla.com. We're live in Hollywood. I'm John Finolio, sending it back to you two in the studio. John, thank you. And of course, stay with us here at KTLA 5 as we continue to track the path of Hurricane Hillary to stay up to date anytime. Actually, check out our interactive radar. It's at ktla.com slash Hillary.